This is Awkward Occurrence with Awkward Entertainment. So, um, somebody left me a message about maybe six minutes ago or eight minutes. It says four minutes. And they left me a message under Michael Long, go fund me or go fraud me, $200,000 video. Now, let's get to the message. Let's add some background. So, we have Michael Long and Sophie Long. Sophie Long is his daughter. He's trying to get custody of his daughter. I don't know where this case is at because I stopped covering the case. I still stopped looking at it. So um, at the beginning of the case, he set up a GoFundMe for him and his lawyer fees and for Sophie. And however many other kids they have in this movie. So they raised $200,000. A few months later, after this money is raised, it's a very, very short time later. Michael Long, Michael Long comes on YouTube. He goes to his YouTube partners he does videos with. Um, whomever you see Michael Long doing videos with on YouTube, that's his partners. He goes to them, gets on camera, says we need more money. It, only two, three months pass, and this man is trying to tell us he ran through $200,000. I don't know who said it was on Laura fees. I don't know what he spent it on, but... Let's go to the person comment who just left me this comment under this video. I did this video video like four or five months ago, so I ain't, I ain't been watching to see if Michael Long is still e-bagging for money for no apparent reason. And I will tell you why, no apparent reason. So the comment is a small group of only of only decent lawyers can burn through 200K. That's what you messed up at. Any lawyer can take a child custody case because all the lawyer is doing is looking through paperwork. That's all he's doing. You don't, you only need one lawyer for a child custody case. Only need, you don't need two hundred thousand dollars in a team of lawyers for a child custody case. The lawyers aren't detectives. The, the lawyers aren't going out and trying to prove Michael Long's statements. They aren't going out. They aren't private eyes going out watching um, Michael Long s wife. To see if she's up to something. I mean, they aren't psychic. They can't read Sophie's mind and see if Sophie is lying or not. I mean, people don't realize what these um, so-called child lawyers do. These custody case lawyers do. They, they sit in the office all day and go through paperwork. And it's not that much paperwork. That, that's it. Th these cases, this Michael Long case, if I was a lawyer... I'm just going to get some files to look through. I may write down a couple of notes. Then I'm going to go to court. Then I'm going to go to court. It might get pushed back again. Okay, it gets pushed back. That doesn't cost money because it gets pushed back. It doesn't cost me the lawyer money because it gets pushed back. So a decent lawyer doesn't cost 200 grand to sit down and look at paperwork, go to court, say yes, no. I mean, come on. What What, what is the lawyer doing? Nothing. Like, basically nothing. I should have went and on YouTube and got some videos of what um, custody lawyers do. Because they don't do nothing. They're not out there running track, catching footballs. They're not building spaceships. I, like, come on. Come on. A small group. So, let's continue. A small group of only decent lawyers, right? You can get any lawyer to look over paperwork. Can burn through 200k in a matter of a month or two. No, they can't burn through 200k in a in a case about child custody. That doesn't make sense at all, dog. Not sure if this case is here, but it would make sense. And without any evidence, yeah, I don't know what else he said. I will go over there and look at it. That's the main part. That's the main part. He doesn't make sense. He doesn't make sense. Yeah, I told him all oh, shut up. He he liked his own post. Look at this. So the post was made four minutes ago. Not four or four minutes ago, but four minutes ago, right? It's already a like on the post. He liked his own post. That's so sad. So sad. So sad. I told him, oh, shut up. Yes. Oh, shut up. Don't like your own post. And he, yeah, he is stupid. Yes. Yes. The mom. The mom. So the mom in this case, she also has, I don't know how many kids. Because Michael Long looked like he has four kids in his picture. So the mom has kids of her own. She doesn't have a GoFundMe. She's never had a GoFundMe. But she continues to come to court whenever there's a court date. She continues to take care of her kids. Uh, everything's fine with the mom. The mom don't need money. But somehow Michael Long needs money. 
Somehow Michael Longs needs 200k plus another 100k or whatever. For what? If his ex wife is doing just fine and she's not rich, by the way, she's not rich. None of these people are rich. They don't, they don't, at least they're not playing rich on TV. So, if she can do it without a GoFundMe, uh, Mr. Long, Michael Long can too. And he's not spending two, he didn't spend 200k on one lawyer or two lawyers. We don't know what he spent it on. I don't care what he spent it on. I really don't care. I just needed to make a video, so I just thought I'd make a video about Mr. Thomas, Mr. Stupid Thomas here. Mr. Stupid Thomas here. And let's look at, but what makes sense, and without any evidence, I don't know what he was going to say. Maybe, like, Michael Long isn't telling people what he's spending their donated money on. He's not saying, so... He's not saying. Again, if the wife didn't need it, Michael Long doesn't need it. It's it's stupid. It's lot it's critical thinking. It's critical thinking. And some stupid fool gonna say, Well, Michael Long bills are bigger. Michael Long bills aren't bigger. It's not. And it's not like this man has gotten another two hundred K either. He hasn't gotten any much more money from people than that two hundred K. Like this is ridiculous, y'all. Uh, this is ridiculous. But what well, some people do buy it, and that's how that's how the mind works. Uh, you're going to have some fools that buy it, and most of the fools won't buy it. Anyway, let's continue the show. Twelve signs you have a spirit God, even though it doesn't say nothing in the Bible about spirit gods. Twelve signs you have a spirit God. You should ask Michael Long about his spirit gods. His voodoo monk trip to China, Tibet, China. He made a phone call to his wife saying he knows his ex-wife, saying he knows magic. We know the story. Told his ex-wife he knows magic. He's going to teach his kids magic. He's going to use magic against his ex-wife. We know the story. So ask Michael Long, 12 signs. Uh, what, what's the 12 signs he has about having a spirit God? Uh, he doesn't have a spirit God. The man's not very religious. He's not very religious. If you're talking about magic, that's not religious. That's just paganism, Wiccan, whatever you want to call it. Whatever you want to call it. You can call it anything. It's all divination. Um, remember, don't tread on Sophie. T-shirts are on sale. Go buy it now. Don't tread on Sophie with the snake with the snake in the garden of Eden. Don't tread on Sophie. And also... It should be named 12 Signs Your Young Daughter Has a Demon in Her. That's what it should be named. That's what it should be named. So I, I imagine some of these people on TV in these cases, deep on the inside, this is how they look, even their kids. Because they can train their kids to be just as demonic as they are. Uh, and you won't see it until they get older, but they can train those kids to be just as demonic. Anyway, that is it for this. Uh, let me flip through some scenery for y'all. Some scenery. Merry Christmas, baby. I sure hope Santa treats you nice. So, let's recap. Uh, somebody left a stupid comment about 10 minutes ago. Um, doesn't cost 200 k just for a lawyer in a custody battle. That's so retarded. His bills don't cost 200k. Um, his ex-wife doesn't have a GoFundMe. She has a bunch of kids also, and she's doing just fine with her lawyer. Uh, it's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. You would figure people will go research what custody lawyers do all day before they leave a comment, y'all. And before you leave this comment, like go research what decent custody lawyers do all day. They all decent because there's nothing to being a custody lawyer. There's nothing but reading a bunch of papers and showing up to court. That's it. That's it. That's it. You want to challenge something that was said in the paper, you challenge something that was said in the papers or the documents. Other than that, they don't do anything all day. When they If they just do custody all day, all they do is read papers all day and take notes. That's nothing. I mean, I mean, uh, crackhead can sit down and take notes all day and read through custody papers and make notes and then show up to court and uh, challenge whatever may be said. It's not rocket science, people. Not rocket science. 
All right, let's get up out of here. Enjoy the scenery. And this has been Awkward Occurrence, Awkward Entertainment, and I will see you in the next video. They act like this shit is like, or trying to figure out if time travel exists or something. This shit is no, no, no. Basic one, two, three math and reading, people.